Well, still on news, celebrating women and their accomplishments as the world recognizes International Women's Day. Today, there are five women in leadership roles in the insurance industry here at home who have broken the glass ceiling tonight. They share their experiences with our Theo Seeley and also their remedy for success. Paulette Turner, Linda Gibson, Anastasia Francis, Chantal Saunders, and Makai Butler, five women in five leading roles within the insurance industry. And with their years of service combined, they bring to the table over half a century of experience. The fabulous five women are leading executives at CG Atlantic, and as the world stops to celebrate International Women's Day today, they reflect on their success and what it took to get there. We have our good days and our bad days, but overall I enjoy what I do. To actually be part of a 100% female leadership team is, is really special. And if they have to agree on one of the biggest challenges in the workplace. It's overcoming just being pushed in the corner, you know, just take notes, be a secretary, just be an administrator. So being allowed to get out there, to speak to clients, to interact with them and take on a leadership role without just being the, the you know, the secretary. Paula Turner, general manager at CG Atlantic General, has 14 years under her belt. She says when she joined the company, it was predominantly ran by males. But she and her four counterparts broke that glass ceiling. So seeing the transition over the last 14 years has been amazing. And it means a lot to me because I feel that the world is shifting, right? So we go from a boys club to an even playing field. Then there's Linda Gibson, Executive Vice President and General Manager at CG Atlantic Medical and Life with 35 years in the field. She's been somewhat of a mentor to women in the company, providing them with lessons from her success and her missteps. And even after three decades in the business, she's confident running neck and neck with her male counterparts as well. Here is her remedy. You just have to work hard and you just don't get caught up in the gender thing or I'm female and they're male and you know, they're getting preferential treatment. No, you just have to be yourself and work hard and compete with the guys. You feel, you feel they could do it just as, oh, just as well or even better? Better. <laughs> Anastasia Francis, Vice President of Health, Chantal Saunders, Operations Manager at CG Atlantic Pensions, and Makai Butler, Agency Manager at CG Atlantic Agents and Brokers, all identify as proud mentees of Gibson. At this stage in their careers, Here's their advice to women looking to excel in their respective fields. It's very easy to become distracted, to become discouraged, um, but you have to have a, a goal and, and, you know, just stay focused. Be yourself. Use your talents that you would have had. Um, sometimes it's not necessarily what you learn in the books, but it's what you would have learned in your character. So use your strengths in that is if it's speaking, if it's helping out, it will help you in your career. Be very careful you know, first impressions of cancer. Be careful what you put on your social media and you know all those engagements that you have with a company are really important. So your resume is a reflection of you. Those first conversations that you have in interviews, you know, they are what we use to make those decisions when we take on people, when we employ people. So um, first impressions really count. To the Fabulous Five, we say kudos on their rise to leadership and wish all women around the country a happy International Women's Day. The O'Seely, Eyewitness News.